everyone, my name is Rimsha Kiani and again I am here to teach you learn English. So in today's lesson, I am going to tell you a very short, interesting and inspiring story and the title of my story is A Magical Spot. So let's start it. Once upon a time, a poor farmer um, was sowing his field and he hit something very large and and it was a very large metal pot then he said i wonder if there is something more valuable than this in the hope that he could find something more valuable the farmer digged more deeper and wider tried after hours of searching he got tired and the farmer decided to uh, take some rest he put his spade in the pot and lay down under the tree a while later when he got up and went back to pot he was so surprised to see that there was a hundred of spades although he put one spade in it. Then the ma uh, farmer thought that uh, it might be a magical pot. Let me see what will happen if I put a mango in it. And then he put a mango in the pot and just as the farmer thought, uh, the farmer had thought, the one mango turned into thousand of uh, mangoes when he left in the pot. Then he take it at home and uh, use it to tide over his troubles. And the farmer and then the farmer went home and uh, hide the pot in at a safe place. And then he went to market uh, to sell those mangoes and he got a very handsome amount of money. And on the way back he bought some grains. He went back to home and put each one of them one by one. Soon he had enough grains to last his family for the rest of the year. Then he called his wife and told her everything that had happened. Uh, then, then she said, this is a blessing. We should use it wisely and uh, to become rich and also keep it safely hidden. The farmer agreed to his wife and over the year he slowly started uh, to put things in the pot like food, vegetable, textile. And in some years, he turns around his family's fortune. Though they were very secretive and very careful about their magical pot, but still people started noticing that how they had become rich. And soon the, the secret was out and even reached to the king's ear. And, and the king said, such a magical and powerful pot should be a part of king's treasury where the farmer has no right to keep. Only I have a right to keep it. The king ordered the soldiers to um, bring the bring that pot to and then the soldiers stormed to the farmer's home and brought it to the king. Then the king said, let me see what is inside the pot that makes it so much. Then I'll become a hundred times more powerful. The king peed over the pot to see inside it. As he did, he lost his balance and, uh, and, and fell. In. As he fell, he hit his head on the edge of the pot and uh, become un. When he woke up, he saw a hundred of kings like him. They all were fought to each other to get to the throne and died. This news reached to the farmer's house and his wife said, should we get our pot back now? The farmer replied that the king is foolish and his curiosity killed him. But it is not safe for us to keep that pot. We have enough money and riches to take care of us and our many next generations. Let, uh, let us leave the pot with the, within the king's treasury. This is all from my side. I hope you like it and if you did, please tell me in the comments down below. Bye bye.